You've probably seen those electric sharpeners that look like magic. I mean, you just put a pencil in and it starts working on its own. Have you ever wondered how those work? Have you also ever wanted to have one? Well, now KiwiCo has an electric pencil sharpener, which satisfies both. First, you get an electric pencil sharpener, and second, you'll learn how it works because you get to build it by yourself. Hello everyone and welcome back to Through Geo's Lens. In this video, I'll be unboxing the KiwiCo electric pencil sharpener, building it, showing you the electric pencil sharpener in action, and then I'll be telling you how it works, and also, I'll be giving you my initial thoughts and impressions. Anyways, let's get started. This video was not sponsored by KiwiCo, nor did they send me this version of the electric pencil sharpener for review, but I do have a referral link down below. So if you've been thinking of buying a KiwiCo product, make sure to use my referral link down below to get a $10 USD discount off your first purchase. Let's unbox the KiwiCo electric pencil sharpener. On the back of this, you can see everything that's included. You get a motor, batteries, a battery pack, a sticky foam sheet, a plastic tube for the pencil shavings. You get two pencil sharpener blades, some wires, and wooden pieces to build the frame of the electric pencil sharpener. You also get four pencils that say Eureka Crate. Now that we know just about everything that comes in here, let's open it up. First, we have our maker's guide. This has a lot of history about the pencil sharpener. We also have the instructions on how to build the pencil sharpener here. Finally, this is what is included. We have a box with four pencils inside that say Eureka Crate. We have our pencil sharpener lid and, and, and the blades for the pencil sharpener. This is our plastic tube. And this is all our electrical components. We have our motor, our battery pack, and four AA batteries. Finally, we have two bags of wooden pieces which will make up the frame of the pencil sharpener and we have a sticky foam sheet and a notebook. Now I'm going to go off to build this and then afterwards I will show you it in action and afterwards I'll try to explain how this works.
Here it is. Our electric pencil sharpener is done. Now, let's test it out. Here, I have a pencil crayon, which as you can see, its tip has been broken off. So let's switch the pencil sharpener on and see how it works. It's on, and now let's put the pencil in. Now, the colored pencil is sharp again. It's really effective and it's fun to use and it's fun to build, but how does it work? Here, there's a battery pack here with a switch. And you'd expect that when you turned it on, it would immediately start sharpening. But no, it's already on, but the motor's not spinning. Why is that? Because the circuit is still open. What this means is that the circuit is incomplete. If this was a train track for the electricity to travel on, the train track isn't complete. But how do you complete that train track? When you push a pencil in, it triggers this piece of metal here, which is a switch. It pushes it, and it basically, it's like connecting a piece of the rail for the electricity to travel from the battery pack to the motor down below. And that is how the electric pencil sharpener from KiwiCo works. So there you have it. That is the KiwiCo electric pencil sharpener from the Eureka Crate. I really enjoy building KiwiCo products and also like this one because I see electric pencil sharpeners almost every day, but I've never actually stopped to wonder how it works. And with this, the electric pencil sharpener from KiwiCo, it takes an everyday product and helps you to understand something that you might never have thought of. If you've been thinking of purchasing this or the Domino machine or any other KiwiCo products, make sure to use my referral link down below to get a $10 USD discount for your first purchase. Anyways, I hope you learned something from this video and I can't wait to see you next time. Bye for now and make sure to subscribe down below. Thanks for watching.